Well, do we look like Do we look like that? <laughs> I don't think so. No. We are cool people, guys. You have learned in business, you have learned in, I don't know, every track. Mm -hmm. I think it's nice that you know you like something and you dedicate it to it. Something like that? No, we... no. They are a little bit crazy. <laughs> Well, uh, maybe sometimes. Many of them, you see them, that they are dedicated only on this and nothing else. Like somebody who, uh, who is perfect with computers, who doesn't need to be a uh, very communicative person. Like. But I think actually that we are some kind of people that stay under a basement and all day program <laughs> or all day make different applications to conquer the world with new technology and everything. Yeah. But yes, yes, I've heard of computer science. Uh, are people with humor, with uh, nice behavior maybe, and I don't think that uh, all of us are nerds and geek. Well, kinda. You have to be part nerd. You really have to like it and be kind of 100% into it, to go with the flow of events, to keep up with the technology. You have to be nerdy. With the psychology guys are more the geeks and nerds. Wow! Excuse me? Mm, yes. Some people see it easier to communicate through the PC than face to face. Does this make them more nerds? Mm, yes. No, they are committed to their work. No, not really. Computer science is for mostly everybody. Do you really believe that? I mean, look at him, he's like a nerd. <laughs> yeah, but that's not his fault. It's, <laughs> it's really nature. Actually, I do believe that computer science is a something for people that in, in the, it requires intellect but doesn't necessarily make one an art. Uh, I shouldn't think so, no. Computer science helps us move forward to the future. Well, nerds cannot really do that. No, my experience tells me no. I have like a, quite a few friends who are into computers and computer science, uh, both grown-ups as well as students, and I think they're very cool guys, and cool, I believe, is the exact opposite of being a nerd. Yes. Who says this? This is not true. Uh, this is a perception. Uh, computer science is not for nerds, for sure. Computer science is for people that they tend to think differently, more in a more creative way, and provide solutions uh, that nobody else would think of. Yes. Uh, they are not very communicative, but nerds, no, no way. Look at him, behind the camera, no. Well, uh, it might be. Uh, it's, it is and it isn't. I don't think that geek is a, a bad word. I, I like being geek, uh, let's say. So if we're talking about the bad meaning of, uh, of the word, certainly computer scientists are not total geeks, no. <laughs> I don't think that the statement that uh, computer scientists or computer science students uh, are not uh, com communicative, even if they are not, as many people are, we try you know, to work on these skills because they are very important for our uh, graduates. So computer science is for geeks. I believe that the term geek and nerd is a stereotype uh, that is imposed by the Hollywood movies primarily. I totally disagree with this uh, idea. Uh, computer science is a field that requires a lot of imagination, a lot of creativity, a lot of thinking outside the box. For an example, the computer science department here, in which uh, there is a magician, a professional guitar player and lead singer, a dancer, and uh, also a professional handball player. Computer science is for nerds. Come on, man. Did you just call me a nerd? I am quite sure that computer science attracts the coolest people ever. I didn't say it for fun. When I say that, you know, we're cool people, mm -hmm. I totally uh, believe that. Computer uh, science students do give the impression of, you know, be being very nice people, very polite mm -hmm. people. It's a myth and uh, obviously there is a reason for this. We see these people in, uh, usually in films, in uh, Hollywood films, and uh, um, they are alone and uh, they have a geeky behavior and um, you know, they eat junk food and uh, they are in a messy room, possibly. Mm -hmm. 
It's stereotyping and it's a distorted view really of a computer scientist in order to, let's say, develop a system, a software, an application. It needs a lot of uh, communication uh, skills. It's a lot. Exactly that.